Hi, it's Melissa with My Membership Minute on Monday, Monday, June 15, 2015. Here's what's new and hot in your membership community this week. Thank you to all of you who requested and expressed an interest in yoga practices for summer solstice this year. Summer solstice celebrates the freedom, joy, and playfulness of the longest day of the year on June 21st in the Northern Hemisphere and December 21st in the Southern Hemisphere. In the northern islands of Alaska and Scandinavia, the sun actually never sets. And from this day forward, the sun's yang energy begins to wane. And our daily hours will start to diminish. So to meet your needs in uh, the summer solstice practices, what I did was I put together a one-day retreat for you to celebrate the summer solstice on Sunday, June 21st, 2015. Now, if you can't practice it on exactly on the day, not to worry, you can always do practices around the day or break it up into chunks that are manageable for you. So you could turn it into your own weekly challenge even if you wanted to. Um, so let me show you where that it is on our membership site. If you scroll all the way down to the retreats, it's the first one here and just click on the summer solstice retreat. And it's all laid out for you, all the directions of what to do. You could take it as a day of silence as well if you want. Uh, all the things to eat and drink, breath practices, walking meditation, journal questions, recipes from Linda, uh, yoga practices, um, suggestions of what to do, and dinner, yoga, nidras, loving kindness practices. So everything's there for you for the whole day. And then you can also leave your comments as well here. And lots of people are commenting already about their plans for the day. Also for our friends in the Southern Hemisphere, uh, they're going to be celebrating winter solstice, the shortest day of the year. So for those of you who are in the Southern Hemisphere, if you look in the retreat section, we do have a winter solstice one day retreat too, and you can do these practices for you. And as I say, I know for sure that Michelle from New South Wales and Australia is planning on doing this one. So it's got a whole outline for a one day retreat uh, for what to do for, for that. And you can go ahead and practice that and make that uh, special for you. So I, I would love to hear from you. How are you going to celebrate the longest or shortest day of the year, depending on where you are in the world? Our family has been doing lots of camping trips and actually we are off this week. Uh, we're going to be camping this week with Trinity's class. And so while we are away, Hannah is going to be moderating the website. So she might be leaving some comments uh, for you if you need help with anything, uh, just to let you give you a little heads up about that. Um, uh, some of you have volunteered to help me out when I take my day of silence on Thursdays or when our family is going to be out of Wi-Fi when we're camping a bit this summer. So I really appreciate that and Hannah's first up this week. So leave me your comments and let me know how you are going to celebrate the full days of summer. And I'll be back from camping this week on the weekend to celebrate summer solstice with you. Namaste.